Hi guys! When we look at the batteries, we encounter units such as V or volts, MAH or milliamp hour, and AH or ampere hour. So, what do these mean? How long can we use a battery? How long will it power a circuit? I will try to answer these questions that we wonder in this video. The life of the battery is calculated by the formula here. It is found by dividing the capacity by the current. The capacity can be milliamp hours or amp hours. Similarly, the circuit current can be milliamps or amps. From here, the battery life is calculated in hours. For example, if a current of 1 milliamp is drawn from a 250 milliamp hour capacity battery, this battery's life will be 250 hours. If the current drawn is 2 milliamps, the life will be 125 hours. The amount of current drawn varies according to the resistance value of the load we connect to the battery. Here we see a 9 volt 2000 milliamp hour battery. This battery can provide 2000 milliamps for one hour. It can provide 1000 milliamps for two hours. It can provide 500 milliamps for four hours. Or it can provide 200 milliamps for 10 hours. Of course, the values here are not exactly the same in real life. Because the chemical reactions in the battery slow down over time and its internal resistance changes, in addition, temperature and service life are also important. Here you see three batteries. All three are 12 volts. But 100 amp hours on the left, 150 amp hours in the middle, and 300 amp hours on the right. So, what's the difference between them? First of all, all three of them can supply 12 volts voltage. For example, when we connect all three of them to a load that will draw 1 amp current, the 100 hours on the left can be used. The middle 150 hours can be used. The one on the right can be used for 300 hours. The higher amp hour value will have a longer life. Many of us look at the battery capacity from the technical specifications when we buy a phone or a charged electronic device. We know that the higher the milliamp hour value, the longer the phone can be used without charging. In the circuit you see here, the source has 9 volts and 3000 milliamp hours. Since about 27 milliamps of current flows through this circuit, how long will this power supply keep the LED on? It takes about 111 hours from 3000 milliamp hours divided by 27 milliamps operation. Of course, the result we found is the best possibility, which is the maximum duration. Although this time cannot be achieved exactly in real life, a close value is obtained. We can connect batteries in series to increase the voltage value. Here, we see that three batteries with a value of 12 volts, 100 amp hours are connected in series. This way, we can get 36 volts, 100 amp hours. Thus, we provide higher voltage, but the service life doesn't change. If we want to increase the usage time so that the voltage remains the same, we can connect the batteries in parallel like here. When we connect it in parallel, we can get 12 volts, 300 amp hours. Thus, we increase the usage time three times. The life of the batteries is basically calculated in this way, guys. I hope this lesson was helpful and you liked it. Hope to see you in the next lesson. Goodbye.